Hello, today we are going to learn how to draw a regular octagon inscribed in a given square. In other words, given the distance d between the octagon's opposite parallel sides. In the top left side of the screen, you can see our given length d. So the first step we are going to do is to draw a horizontal line on the bottom of our screen. On the left side, we are going to mark a point p, which will be the first vertex of our square. So next step, setting our compass to the given length d, we are going to transport this onto our horizontal line by setting our compass on the point p and scribing an arc to obtain the second vertex, which we will call q, as can be seen here. So this is the first side of the square that we are going to draw. So the next step is to draw two perpendicular lines going through points P and Q. As can be seen here. You can use a protractor, whatever method you like to draw the perpendicular lines. And now with our compass set on to the length d and setting on vertex p we scribe an arc until the left until it cuts our previously drawn perpendicular line at a third vertex of our square now we repeat the process setting our compass on q to obtain our fourth vertex we scribe an arc on the vertical line and finally we join these two steps and we will call these new vertices R and S. So now we have completed the square. The next step is to draw a diagonal line joining vertex P to vertex R, as can be seen here, and another diagonal line joining vertex Q to vertex S. Where these diagonal lines cross at a center point that we will call O. So now, setting our compass on the vertex P, and with a radius PO, we scribe an arc, cutting the horizontal and vertical sides of the square, as shown here. These will be two vertices of our octagon. Now we are going to continue this process with the other three vertices of the square, to obtain the remaining six vertices of the octagon. Now continuing, setting our compass on vertex R, and with the same radius, we scribe another arc, arc, cutting the top side of the square and the right side, as can be seen here. And finally, setting our compass on vertex S, and with the same radius, we scribe two more arcs, cutting the left side of the square and the top of the square. Now that we have obtained the eight vertices, we are going to name them from A to H, as shown here. And the final step is to join these eight vertices with a thicker line from A to B, B to C, C to D, D to E, E to F, F to G, G to H, And finally, from H to A. So here we have our octagon, our eight-sided regular polygon inscribed in a given square. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Press like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Until the next time.